Hello and welcome to my first home project vlog. The reason I started this channel was to start documenting the building of our house and totally planned on documenting like little projects that we do around the house and it's been about eight months and haven't done a project. Today I'm doing my first project and it's kind of a risky one in the sense that it could look bad but if it looks anything like the inspiration pictures hey Lizzie where are you going? Just leaving. Okay location change but this is actually where I'm going to be doing my project. I'm going to be painting our front door black. I'm also going to be painting the inside of it black and our back door inside and outside black. And if that looks good, might be doing the pantry door too. So right now, this little chick is playing and I am cleaning the door. Scrubbing it down, getting all the dirt out um, so that the paint will stick. So this is the paint I got. Bare Ultra Stain Blocking Paint and Primer in Ultra Black. Ultra, just black, I think. And satin. So I already cleaned the inside. This is what it looks like before I paint it. I think it's gonna look really good with the black frames on those prints and the black metal on this piece of furniture, yeah. removed and I stuffed socks on there to keep the AC in and the bugs out because our flies are crazy right now. Got a drop cloth taped over there, taped to the table. Can't believe I'm doing this. Okay. It's about to happen. We changed into clothes I don't care about. It's so black. Here it goes. Okay. First couple spots are on. Already got black all over me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Taking a little break. As you can see, it's kind of streaky in some spots. So, I'm reevaluating re my, <laughs> my life a little bit. Okay, first coat is on. I'm feeling a lot better about it. <laughs> I think it's gonna look really good. So whenever I step back and kind of take in the whole entryway, I like it. So now I'm about to take this little Lizzie paintbrush to go around these. <laughs> As you can see, it's still spotty, but the second coat will take care of that. Okay, I've moved outside. Okay, it is the next day, and the project yesterday was a lot longer time investment than I realized it would be. I mean, I've always known I hate painting, but I was like, it's a door, it's just a door. It's not gonna be a big deal. Well, it was a big deal. Here is the outside door. I mean, it's the same door, but here's the outside view. We'll get back, see the whole house. I absolutely love the way it looks. I just ordered some new address numbers because those look super dated to me. So they're black and a little bit more bold and more modern. And we also want to get black shutters to put on these windows and then get nicer <laughs> patio furniture. This is just stuff we've had for years. I mean, I love Lizzie's little pink one, but we want to get black metal patio furniture. So yeah, I think with all of that considered, Love the black door. Um, I also think it looks really good with the fans that my hubby installed. What are you doing? Oh, you found a leaf. And this is the finished product of the inside. I love it. I really, I'm just 
couple moments where I wasn't so sure what I was gonna think, but I really like it. See like this, in the camera, it looks like I missed a spot, but it's just a shine like this, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, really like it. This is what we're working with with our back door area. I love this wine rack. I'm not sure I love it here. And we've got stuff, compost stuff in this. This holds all of our wine bottle openers. And then we've got our wine glasses and then another wine rack, which also serves as dog treat holder. <laughs> you wanna go upstairs? I think I'm gonna do this next weekend, but obviously I'm gonna remove the blinds. And I, I'm gonna remove this thing too, cause I wanna keep that white to match the trim. So yeah, the door will be black. This will be completely redone. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I really like this, but I want it to be just wine. So I feel like we need like a little shelf unit here instead of another wine rack, but I'm not sure where we would put this. So anyway, <laughs> that's gonna be my next project. Um, yeah. update on our entryway so since I painted the door black I got inspired to redo like the whole entryway so there's been two more things added since my last video so first thing I added is this black lamp which it's metal this is metal the whole thing is metal and I thought it looked really nice with the black metal down here and the black frames up here and then I added a greenery wreath on the inside of the door which Matt thinks is kind of odd because we're on the inside of the house but I just wanted something to kind of soften up the black door and I think it looks really nice so tell me what you think I'm back it's the next weekend I can't really tell how I look sorry um, something else we're gonna do is change the address numbers on the front of the house. This is what we have right now. Just very traditional cheese <laughs> numbers that I thought would look cool to make them more modern and than traditional. We're going to Home Depot later and I'll get some wood putty to fill in the holes from the other ones. And we have this white paint from when they painted the house. Yay! Oh my gosh, I like that so much better. Okay, another project we've got going on this weekend is handles for our cabinet in our kitchen and in both of our bathrooms. So we chose these black, of course. I'm on a major black kick. Oh, my boat. You want your boat? Yeah. Do you like the handles right here? Do you like your handles? <laughs> so Matt's been installing them. He's been doing a great job. I love the way they look. Then, yesterday I decided but I really liked the idea of having extra long ones on our drawers, because our drawers in our kitchens, are, our kitchen is very long. So let me show you. So we have two drawers in our kitchen and they're really big wide drawers. So I just thought it would look really cool to have these like super long, it's the exact same handle, but it's 15 inches. Just add it like a little bit more of like a custom look. That's about to install the first one on this drawer, which is another long drawer. And then we've got this drawer right here, which is a faux drawer, but I think we're still gonna put a handle on it just for the cosmetic aspect, because then it'll match the other two over here. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. Let's 
first of the big long handles that we're putting on. Not gonna lie, measuring it out to make sure it's perfect is pretty stressful and drilling into your white cabinets is pretty stressful. <laughs> The master bathroom. I'm just gonna show you how the bathrooms looked after he put handles on. I'm not gonna zoom out because real life is above this film, this frame. I've got Lizzie's Hello Sunshine bathroom, but she got the same handles as us. I think they look so good. Okay, it is still the same day as the cabinet pulls but I changed clothes because I'm about to paint the back door. So, Matt took off the blinds and the like frame that goes across the top and the metal pieces. Oh man, I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> that held the frame. So I'm gonna paint this black. I'm gonna leave this, the, like the window frame white. And I just taped off the drop cloth. I'm just doing the inside tonight, and then tomorrow is when I will do the outside because it's been a day. Calling it a day for today, but got the majority of the inside of the door done today. It's still wet. Um, we're taking off the hardware tomorrow and then we'll paint that obviously. And then I'll be doing the outside of the door and then we'll put the blinds back on. Okay, we had an exciting delivery today. One that I'm most excited about, and it is the rug for this room. I'm having to be very careful with my camera because Lizzie just got out of the bath. But this is the before, and here's the after. I absolutely love this rug. I love it. <laughs> we might work on placement since it, it stops right there, but since this is since it's an L-shaped chaise couch, I feel like it makes sense that it's right here because this is like where we are. Um, but we'll see. We got this um, a few days ago, I guess it was last week, on during Prime Day. A six by nine rug for only $56, I think. Here's a shot of it with the black door in the background, which is another reason I wanted to get a rug that had like a few black specks to tie in the black door. Um, ignore the mop. We mopped and cleaned the entire floor we put before we put the rug down, but yeah, I really like it. So I realized I kind of left the back door hanging in the video and then just skipped to the rug the next day. But now it's the next day after that. And I'm gonna give you an update on how the back door is coming. It has turned out to be way more involved than the front door, which I thought it was gonna be the exact opposite, but that's just how painting goes. So originally, I had said it's kind of hard to see because of the backlighting of the outside, but I had said I was going to keep the, the frame around the glass white, but after Matt expressing his opinion and me getting a second opinion in my best friend, Christina, 
They both agreed that it, it was kind of weird to leave this white. And now that, and so this is, I have the first coat on. Um, so obviously it's not gonna stay that streaky. But yeah, I think it was definitely the right decision. I think it just looks better in general. Let me show you the outside. Here's the outside. Um, have like a one and a half coat on the outside. Our doorknob is like really, whenever we first moved in, this is one of the things that we had to have the builder come back and work on because the door wasn't like latching. And he worked on this doorknob for so long. And in my dad's words, he redneck rigged it or something. I don't know. What, baby? Here we have it. I love, love, love the way it looks. Okay, so that wraps up my first home project video. This was so much fun to film and document. I'm really proud of all the projects we did and just new little touches to our home. What started as just painting the front door black turned into a new rug, new address numbers for the front of our house, um, painting the back door, and of course the cabinet handles. Um, yeah, I'm just very proud of us and I'm definitely gonna try to continue documenting when we do home projects like this because I think they're super fun to watch. So hopefully you enjoyed this and let us know what your favorite thing, favorite change was that we did. And I'll see you in the next one.